Rio DeLulu got her name tatted two weeks into this talking stage. <laughs> Oh my lord, have mercy. <laughs> what is even going on here, man? Like, <laughs> I cannot advocate for this. I cannot, I cannot relate to this. I can, I just, this is, this is, the, this ain't even the Lulu. This is a whole, the Lulu right here, bro. This is a whole kind of another step, man. Like, this is, this is a, this is a decision, bro. I don't know what she got going on. She got one of them, uh, she got some superpowers or something. She must have some real, uh, you know, some heat. <laughs> this is crazy. This is, like, there need to be a, there need to be a disclaimer on this right here. Like, kids, do not try this at home. Because, <laughs> like, this is right here. This is one of them decisions. It's, it's either going to go real well or most likely it's going to go real, real bad. <laughs> And maybe you just wanted some new ink, you know, you ain't know what to do. You just ran out of ideas, but I don't know, man. I, I don't know what what led to this right here. I need to know. I need I need more details. <laughs> Let me send this to him. Hey, man. <laughs> Please do not send me this. <laughs> if you my girl and you see this, do not send me this. Oh, actually, no, this is a talking stage. If, we, if we're in a talking stage and you send me this, bro, I'm out of there. <laughs> I am gone. <laughs> Your expectations is uh, need to be brought down a little bit. <laughs> this right here, this is one in about 10 billion. There's like 8 billion people on this planet. This is about one in 8 billion right here. Lord have mercy. Need a man like this? <sighs> man. See what you done did, bro? <laughs> See what you done did? Now you, now you got them talking about, oh, I need a man like this. Man. Listen, if you need a man like this, you ain't gonna find him. <laughs> Cause this is not what you want your man like you. Oh yeah, I need him obsessed. I need him all about me. <laughs> all right, listen, this is, if he's getting your name tatted after two weeks, uh, you just wait, you gonna get what you asked for. Wait till about three, four months down the line when y'all ain't, when it ain't so rosy, we gonna see what's going on. Nah, this is actually crazy, like. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only one that thinks so. Maybe I'm just tri I thought I was tripping, man. Maybe this is like cool. Maybe this is normal. Hey, but <laughs> nah, this is actually crazy. Not crazy to Lulu, bro. Not even the Lulu. This is some next level shit. Like I said, bro. Like this. This is not the Lulu. Like the Lulu folks, like, okay, we can we can leave y'all over there. Like y'all cool, but like this, I don't know what to call this. <laughs> hey, let me know in the comments, bro. What do you call this right here? Like, have you ever been at this point? Lord have mercy. Heavy on you won. Ha. What did I win though? What? What did I really win though? Is it like, is it a, like, this gotta be some kind of cash prize. Maybe this is a bet. Is this a bet? <laughs> There's gotta be some kind of hidden reasoning, bro. I definitely did not win after this. <laughs> Where do I get one of these? <laughs> Where do I get one of these? Yeah, try Walmart. Mm, okay, yeah, it probably is Walmart. <laughs> you could probably find a guy like this at Walmart, like on the outside. <laughs> Somebody that would touch a name up at the two weeks. Like he must not, uh, must not have too much going on. Maybe you find him at the Walmart. Literally carved his name in my thigh, and we just started talking again this week. Hmm. That's very interesting. <laughs> Oh man, man. y'all must y'all just leave y'all with these tattoos, but y'all just need y'all just need y'all need material, bro. Like y'all just need like some new ideas. Like, maybe you should have went to a different kind of tattoo shop or something. Like what? Did your artist not say nothing? They're like, hey, are you sure? Like this is like this is it right here. <laughs> she probably asking the question. Oh, so this is like your, your husband? Uh, y'all been together for a couple of years? Nah, we just got back together this week. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Must be so nice. Mm. Listen, ladies, be careful what you ask for. <laughs> there's plenty of there's plenty of brothers out here that will do this for you, but uh the aftermath, it might not be what you want. <laughs> like, there's plenty of brothers out here that might do this, but like listen, the aftermath, like what happens after, 
I'm just saying, like, you might might just want to get ready. <laughs> he tried to convince me, but I didn't, and we are not together. <laughs> it's a talking stage, bro. A two-week talking stage. Like, the, the, there's a 99% chance that in the next two weeks, we aren't going to be talking anymore. <laughs> I'm going to have you forever, though. <laughs> you, hey, always me and you, baby. <laughs> Even though you want to the next one. My me getting my ex name tatted, my ex's name tatted. That's how it always ends up. Like now, this might be good. And like this is gonna get you a lot of play on TikTok. This is good. You know the TikTok girls in the comments gonna love it and all that. But that's how you like a couple months later when somebody asks you, hey, what is what's that on your arm? Oh yeah, it's my ex. <laughs> my ex talking stage. You don't ever. Please don't tell them it was a talking stage. <laughs> They might look at you funny when he thinks I'm a I'm gonna fall in love with him with no contribution to my life But texts and calls ooh, mm, Yeah, that ain't <laughs> That ain't gonna cut it man. Listen, them, this is all this text and calling and all that. It's not really a It's not leaving no imprint on me. Like yeah, it's cool. You know, it's fine You know, maybe we have good conversations and all that but come on now Texts and calls bro. Like what I'm doing with that? <laughs> What I'm doing with that? That's like imaginary. It's imagination at that point. Like that ain't even like no real stuff, man. <laughs> that ain't gonna make her fall in that fall in no love over no texts and calls. Yeah, all different. Y'all got different love definitions than me. Where's the flowers, the dates, the money? <laughs> I was with you at flowers and dates. The money. <laughs> The money is that which one which one what's the, like the order of that is what's more important the flower the dates the money I would probably guess which one <laughs> I'd probably guess which one will make you fall in love the fastest heavy on the money. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's okay Is that is that what love is built off of money? <laughs> what kind of love is that is that that real like deep love that I've been missing? <laughs> Oh, man, literally can DoorDash anything at this point, and they still don't, man. <laughs> yeah, you DoorDash anything at this point. She right about that. For real, give me your money. Oh, this <laughs> just demanding it. Hey, hey, talk about say what you want. You might get it. Okay, say give me your money. <laughs> just be honest. Hey, listen, if I, hey, if you my girl, but just say go ahead and come out with it. Hey, give me your money. Done. I don't even ease into it, bro. I just be like, hey, I need that. <laughs> then he gonna hit you with the well, what can you do for me? Ooh, that's kind of a good question, though. <laughs> that's kind of a good question. That probably is what he gonna say. Like, <laughs> that probably would be what I say. <laughs> that's a good line, right? What you gonna do for me? Like, it's gotta be a mutual kind of thing, bro. This ain't one way traffic. <laughs> but what you could do for me is hit that like button, man, and leave a comment down below. Uh, have you, are you just texting and calling, but you think she's going to fall in love with you? Let me know, man. And until next time, I'll catch you later.